Hello everyone, I am Shadha Shurao and welcome to Shadha Learning Hub. Today's session, we are going to learn cut command in the Unix. See here, now I am going to discuss about this video covers the cut command and what are the options, different options are available in the cut command. Now, the cut command, it's like a sort, cut is also a filter, it cuts or picks up a given number of characters or fields from a specified file say you can uh, say you have a large database of the student informations uh, if uh, from this you want to view only a few selected fields for instance students id and the course names uh, cut is an answer if you want to get the large information uh, uh, if you want to get the information from a large databases cut command is also very useful to get the data from the particular databases now i just know i'm created uh, like one simple database that is called the student it's a structured file nothing but not it's not a database it's a structured file i'm using the cut command to cut the data from that particular file See, finally, like sort, cut is also a filter. It cuts or picks up a given number of characters or fields from a specified files. Say you have to a large databases of students' informations. If you from uh, if uh, from this you want to view only a few selected rows, for instances, students' ID and course names, uh, cut is the best answers to get the data from that particular files. Now. I can show you how the cut command will work. For that, see here, I have a student file, structured file. I can show you student structured file. I'm using the, to display the file, I'm using the cat command, s-t-u-d-e-n-t-s. See, this is the data is available in my student file. The student file is a structured file. Now, I'm going to cut hyphen f 1 comma 3 students see here 1 comma 3 means first column and the third column this is the first column this is the second column this is the third column this is the fourth column i am asking to cut the columns first column and the third column it will be cut the data from first column and the third column and it will be show at it in the here now it displays the output it the student files the first field and the student id and the third field course will be displayed the next one i'm going to a simple example cut hyphen f 225 students See here, whatever I'm, what I'm giving it here, I'm giving whatever the columns I need, just I'm giving the column numbers. That's why it display the column numbers. But here I am giving the range, two to five columns means this is the first column, second, third, fourth. This is the second column onwards. I am asking second column, third column, fourth column. If the fifth column is available, if the fifth column also, I'm asking the range two to two, two to five columns in the student table that's why student structured file in the that's why it's going to display the second column and third column and fourth column if the there is no fifth column is available in my file that's why it didn't display the if it is available it display the fifth column also the cut command can also cut the specified columns from my file and display them on a standard output the switch uses uh, from this purpose is uh, hyphen wo from this example now next i'm going to discuss the one more option cut hyphen c1 hyphen 15 students see i am asking the first 15 characters means see here 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. See here, there is a 15 characters are available at here. If you check it here, 3, tab is the 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, tab is the 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, one tab is there, 10, 11, one tab is there, 12, 13, 14, 15. 
means the first column it displays the 15 data 15 uh, 15 characters means if it display the 15 characters now this is also 15 characters i think so 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 up to tab see here from here to here up to tab this is the 15 characters means it display the column 1 with the 15 characters this is the another way to use the cut command see here i am using the cut command here i am whatever the columns you need i am separating with a comma and the second command whatever the columns you need we can give it into the range also whenever you are giving the range it will be display the that particular range if you are separated with the comma it will display that particular columns only if you are giving the uh, particular uh, range means particular number for a particular column it will display the that many characters this is the way to use the cut command finally the cut like sort cut is also a filter command it cuts or pick up a given number of characters or fields from a specific thank you so much watching this video hope this lesson helpful to you keep watching our lessons keep writing to us do not forget to subscribe our channel Sadot Learning Hub because we have many sessions that would help you to develop our skills and I will be back soon till then you take care bye bye.